So uh, this 7650, as we know the convergent factor, uh, 7650 we divide by 360, which comes 21.25. And if we take the residual uh, 20.25 and multiply, multiply it by 360, that comes 90. So in this conversion table, if you see the 90 price here uh, is zero degree of cancer. Now, zero to one degree of cancer, if we see uh, here, let me put the highlighter here. So this is a, this is a, uh, this is a price line, which is Saturn price lines. As I said, the Saturn and Mars is very, very important for the NASDAQ. So this is a Saturn price line and zero degree cancer is the price which we converted, uh, the longitude which converted to the price of 7650 which, with these conversions. Zero degree to one degree cancer and Saturn at two degrees of Capricorn. What aspect is this? The price is making some aspect with the, with the Saturn price. And this is the exact trine. So what is happening? The prices are getting a resistance here, exactly on the Saturn line. This is not a coincidence. Let's let's go further. Now uh, we have taken we have po pointed all these important tops and bottoms. I'm elaborating them and uh, giving them in detail that how they uh, worked. So here, this price is 7851, which is getting a resistance, which got a resistance on the April of 25th, 2019. If we did this conversion, uh, divide by 360, residual, multiply by 360, 288, 288 in our conversion table will be 18 to 19 degrees of Capricorn. Now, if we go through this planetary position of that day of April 25th, 18 to 19 degree Capricorn, you can see that something is there. It's making a conjunction to the Saturn price again. And why this price is getting, um, this price is uh, not, not, is getting a resistance over there because the, the planet, the prices of a, uh, asset class when it is converted to a longitude it is making it is getting a uh, resistance when the same some some planetary line is there at those longitude does it make sense 18 19 degree of capricorn this is a your saturn line this is the ephemeris uh, ephemeris of that day and you find that it is making an exact conjunction to that point price are not moving up they got sold off next now this is a low of june 3rd 2019 we are we are going through nasdaq only so we just saw that 78 uh, in the in the previous slide we saw the 7815 how these certain um, how this certain line acted as a resistance it couldn't cross and then it came off uh, again, the Saturn line tried to find some support, but again gave up, then came off here. Now let's do this conversion, 6936 low of June 3rd. If we do the conversion here, it comes to seven to eight degrees of cancer. And if you see here, seven to eight degrees of cancer, is there anything making sense to Saturn price to seven to eight degrees of cancer? I think, this Mars and Saturn here, which is coming together, it is making a strong point. And Mars is at 11 degrees of Cancer, which is like conjunction to the price. And Saturn is at 19 degrees of Capricorn. It is, it is a bit wide, but still it is an aspect. So this point in, the, in, in this point on the chart has become activated point because of the Mars presence here at 11 degrees and seven, eight degrees and 11 degrees almost conjunct. So prices are getting in sync with the zodi uh, with the longitude of the asset class prices. So 78 degrees of cancer here, which is coming from uh, this conversion here, 
the mass is also there so it is very very predictable now <clears throat> this is a july 26 2019 we are continuing with the nasdaq only we are going in uh, going with a in detail that um, what we want to do we don't want to uh, we don't want to see only one or two instances and come to a conclusion that these planetary price lines have some impact you want to see number of cases and see that does it makes any sense or it is just a uh, uh, just a coincidence. So if we go through here on July 26, 2019, high of 8027, again, we are doing the same uh, conversion here. It is coming to, uh, this is price, divide by this. This is your 22.297222 uh, is the, uh, uh, outcome if we remove this and we multiply this residual by 360 we get the longitude so 108 on this uh, on our conversion table will be 18 to 19 degrees of the cancer now if we open this 16 july uh, uh, position of the planets on the on the uh, so 18 19 degrees of cancer does it make is it making any sense to the price of uh, uh, price of Saturn, no, because I am not looking at Saturn. If we, if a price is making a high, and if it is, as I told that it's not the only one or two planet or planetary price lines are affecting, as we move in the time, other planets come into action. So I was looking at the chart, I was finding the prices are overbought, it is getting something, some traction is there. It is not making a high, a higher high. It is finding the volumes are dipping. If you go through a daily chart and if you see that, the something is cooking up here. And if I do the conversion and if I see what is happening at 18, 19 degrees of cancer and around, is there any aspect, any planet is there which is making an aspect to this. And if I see here, I was surprised that Neptune came into the picture and it was making exact trine to the price. 18 degrees of Nap Pisces and 18 degrees of Cancer. That's a trine. It got a resistance here. The prices are high enough here. And then what happens? It, came, it comes down. 